It is extremely flavorful and nutrient dense. It is an excellent source of protein and healthy fat as well as micronutrients including selenium, iron, and niacin. I was just reading about today's ingredient, which is... Let's make something delicious, shall we? Get fresh duck breast from your local butcher and we have to cure it overnight. Pat them dry with a paper towel, especially the blood clots. Trim off extra amount of fat on the side and remove the silver skin. Score the skin side so the fat could render out when you heat it. Apply a generous amount of cure mix on both sides. The duck cure mix recipe will be posted on my website. Grab a proper container and store the cured duck in your fridge overnight. Next morning, rinse the cured duck completely, otherwise it's going to be too salty. Again, pat them dry with the paper towel. Get your vacuum sealing bags ready. Put the duck press in. And in the bag, you're going to add knob of butter. And each bag gets one clove of garlic. and a sprig of thyme. And you seal it with your vacuum sealer. And we are going to sous vide at 140 degrees Fahrenheit for one hour and 30 minutes. Use your 21st century high-tech mechanical hand to fully submerge the bags into the water bath. Trim off the head and the tail of the beads and use the clean brush to scrub the surface. Cut them into two cubic centimeter dices. Crush some garlic cloves and mix them with the beets in a bowl. Add thyme, oil, salt, mix. Put everything in the roasting pan and cover it with aluminum foil. And this goes in the oven at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for 20 minutes. 
In the meantime, let's make the dressing. Finely chop shallot about 1 tablespoon. Add some thyme, of course without the stems. Add orange zest. And freshly squeezed orange juice. Don't forget the cider vinegar and the elegant Grand Manier. Season with salt and pepper and whisk. Peel an orange and remove the white membranes and cut them into segments like this. Remove pistachio shells and rough chop them. Ooh, the ducks are ready. Pat them dry first and sear them on hot skillet. Baste with butter, garlic, and thyme to add extra flavor. And rest for 8 minutes. For the salad, season baby arugula and add the dressing that you made. And please do not overdress the salad, it kills the texture. Slice the rested duck and we're ready to plate. For this one, I would choose a pasta bowl. Build the arugula salad on the bottom. Sprinkle coarsely chopped pistachio on top. and place the roasted beets around the salad. Orange segments around. And gently place the sliced stuff on top of the salad. Little bit more of that orange dressing. This is it. Thank you for watching, ladies and gents, and don't forget to hit the subscribe button. I will see you next time.